okay uh, today we will see how to do the common drain amplifier using cadence tools so first launch your license and after that just go to file new cell view and this is my library in that I will create my cell view as CD underscore amplifier and plus common drain amplifier schematic click ok ok after that just go to create instance browse and uh, go to gpdk 180 click on nmos symbol we need to get some parameters here so just edit this length to 1 micro 1 micro and this width to 50 micro okay total words hide place it here okay and the one also place it here after placing this one just click on it and now go to properties and change the parameters make it as 10 micro okay apply okay so after that we need some pins here so for that go to the pin make the direction as out input so vdd vss v in and v bias v i p s v bias these are our input pins for this experiment just place it vdd vss v in and v bias we need one more pin that is V out, V O U T. V out, make the direction as output. So just place it here. So after that, complete the circuit using the wire. Connections will be made as in the circuit diagram. So connected to this, this will be connected to this. And this, this, and this goes here. This will be connected. This, and this will be connected. Yes, okay. Click on check and save. So after that let's create the symbol of it so for that create cell view from cell view ok and rearrange the pins so for that we really place it cut it and place it as top pin vss v bias cut it and paste it here after V bias, we will place a VSS pin. Cut it. Paste it here. Paste it here. Okay. Click OK. Now we will get the symbol of a common drain amplifier. Just close it. And let's create a test bench of it. Of course, file new common drain amplifier underscore db click ok so go to the create instance browse and go to your library so here my library is atme ce so in that i am doing the common drain amplifier so just click on it here just click on hide and place it here so after that we need some sources for that go to create instance browse go to analog library click here v sign mm. here make the x magnitude as 1 and offset voltage is 0 and uh, amplitude 5 milli and frequency 1k 
frequency one k just click on hide and place it here okay after that we need some dc sources that is vdc vdc so dc voltage dc voltage with 0.5 click on hide place it here to 0.51 and here 2.5 place it here click escape okay this make it as minus 2.5 minus 2.5 volts click on apply and voltage because the given constant is like that so that's why according to the test bench diagram we are placing the components so after that we need a pin that is a v out v o u t v out make the direction as output click on hide and place it here and we need one more component called ground so let's go to create instance and type here gnd ground it's available in the analog library click on hide and place it here here Here. Complete the connection as per your test bench diagram as shown in the figure. So complete this circuit. Complete the connections. Okay, now it's completed. We missed two connections here. Just complete it. Here, click on check and save. There will not be any errors detected. So after that, we will go for a launch ADEL. That is, we are doing the analysis of AC, DC, and transient for the common drain. Just click on here, transient analysis for transient analysis. Click on five milli, moderate. Okay. So next, we will do the DC analysis. Save DC operating point component parameter select component and uh, just click it here. Make the range as it is minus for you to five. So this is our DC range. So click on apply and go for AC. AC and let's start and stop time will be 150. 200 mega and make it as a logarithmic 20 points per decade so apply ok ok now click on setup outputs from schematic click on input and output click the run button ok uh, we will get the AC, DC and transient analysis of this waveform. This completes your uh, test bench to do the uh, layout of this uh, common drain amplifier. So before launching the layout, let's check the properties of the transistor once. You confirm that the body type is detached or integrated. Now I have given the option as detached because the source is not connected to the body so for this component it's connected to the body source is connected to the body so that's why I given it as integrated okay so after confirming this just go to launch layout excel okay okay Th after that you will get this window So in this go to connectivity generate all from source. Okay, okay. Shift F to change the view. Just first select all the things together and go to connectivity nets show hide and incomplete nets. So after that you, j you need to rotate the components. So just select this one, right click on it, rotate. Alright, mm, if 
for this also rotate to rotate and right okay now this component change this snipe mode to any angle it's for your comfort you can move the components anywhere you want easily by choosing the snap mode for that you need to press F3 next to move and place the component properly okay, after that select the planes at once move to size area where it's easy to connect so I'll place it here see the connections here at the same time same these let's see here so it's connected to the this terminal it's connected to this terminal so you need to flip this component for easy connections so rotate go to flip vertical it's flipped so now you can observe these things now it's a straight thing so you can connect it straightly so okay so after that you need to place the pin so just click on it go to properties which pin it is it is V in so move let's connect it to here so this is a VSS this terminal as well as this terminal so I place it in between these two terminals so it's easy to connect okay for easy connections and uh, let's see which pin it is V by S so place it here V by S it has only one connection that which pin it is is V out so for this pin so it is connected to the this terminal as well as this terminal V out so for this what I will do I will place it here for easy connections ok and after that let's see which pin it is it's a VDD so it has only one connection is our V out pin place it here so after that let's start the connection so, hmm. so let's start the connection so just place the wire wherever you require so in this experiment we need two wires for this one V in and for V by S pin because those terminals are connected to the poly material so that's why metal is made up uh, sorry pin is made up of a metal and uh, 
the terminal which it needs to connect is a poly so that's why we need a wire here so let's connect it let's connect it after that for this one just click here and connect it finish okay and for this connection it is connected here it's connected here right after that so it's connected from this terminal so for that click it here place it inside this one okay after that for this for this pin it's connected to the both the terminals this as well as this so let's say it's showing the connection to this as well as this so first what I will do I will connect this terminal so here the width is very very important okay so for that So after connecting this, place the point as it is or I just extend this one key to here. Now the pin is totally inside this metal strip. think all the connections are completed so after that go to Ashura and run DRC okay okay yes yes no DRC errors so after doing this we go for the LVS that is layout versus schematic so let's check is there uh, the schematic and layout is matched or not it takes some time okay zero mismatches so it's matched layout connections and as well as the schematic connections are matched so we have got zero mismatches okay after that close this one go to Ashura and run rcx okay F after running this click ok yes okay wait for some time what the AV extracted view is there so press close so go to file open and click the view here as extracted AV extracted view that is parasitic extraction of common drain amplifier so these are the components which are of a red color box with a red color box so shift f you can change the view of this one the box will convert it into the components okay this completes the layout of common drain amplifier circuit so this is the parasitic extraction view that is a v extracted view of a common drain amplifier thank you this is a binan thank you